how to raise domain and forest functional level in Windows 7 2012 R2. Domain functional level and forest functional level allows administrator to enable domain of forest wide Active Directory features within your network environment while maintaining compatibility with older operating systems. The functional level of the domain of forest depends on the version of domain controller in your domain of forest. After all of the domain controllers are upgraded within a domain of forest, the domain of forest functional level can be upgraded as well so that the newer features can be made available. In Windows Server 2012 R2, there are four available domain functional levels and that are Windows Server 2008, Windows Server 2008 R2, Windows Server 2012 and Windows Server 2012 R2. If you have a multiple domain within a tree, you can upgrade the functional level of domain without affecting the other domains. If you are sure that no domain controller that run Windows Server 2012 or any earlier operating system will ever be added to the domain of forest, select the Windows Server 2012 R2 functional level and that is the highest functional level in Windows Server 2012 R2. We can use Active Directory domain and trust snapping or we can use PowerShell to raise domain and forest functional levels. So let's see how to raise the domain functional level in Windows Server 2012 R2. And for this demonstration, I have a domain controller named srt-dc01.mylab.local and we have a single domain with one domain controller in our Active Directory forest. So let's open Active Directory users and computers console. From this console, you can only raise the domain functional level. So right click on your domain, in my case that is mylab.local and select raise domain functional level. Now from this console, you can select the available domain functional level. Right now, as you can see the current domain functional level is Windows Server 2008. You can select Windows Server 2008 R2, Windows Server 2012 and Windows Server 2012 R2. Let's select Windows Server 2012 R2. Let's click on raise and click on OK. OK. And now, if we again select the property of our domain. From here, you can see a domain functional level is Windows Server 2012 R2, but the forest functional level is Windows Server 2008. Let's click on OK. Let's close this console and let's open Active Directory, Domain and Trust Console. On this console, this is the other domain. Now select Active Directory, Domain and Trust and right click on it and select Raise Forest Functional Level. Now from this, you can see the current forest functional level that is Windows Server 2008 for our forest mylab.local. local. Let's select Windows Server 2012 R2 forest functional level and then let's click on raise. Now here we are receiving one warning message. These changes affect the entire forest. After you raise the forest functional level, it is possible that you may not able to reverse it. Let's click on OK. Let's click on OK. And now Let's right click on it and select raise forest functional level and from this console you can see our current forest functional level is Windows Server 2012 R2. From Windows Server 2008 R2, we now have the tools to able to revert back to the previous domain or forest functional level. So by using Active Directory domains and trust snap-ins, we can graphically Raise domain and forest functional level in Windows Server 2012 R2. That's it for this video demonstration. Thank you for watching this video.